What is up, Controlled Chaos Gaming? This is Andy. I'm Matt. I'm Breeze. And I'm TJ. I just walk slower. <laughs> He's over there. And today we're bringing you a regional championship. Welcome back to the regional series. This is Salt Lake City. So exciting. Well, this is Meridian. Yeah, this, this is Meridian. Meridian. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's okay. I'm going to be playing Garatina. I'm going to be playing Palky and Tellian. I'm also playing Paul Kia and Talia. <laughs> no, we decided and just I'm now. We decided that just Let's now. go! So two and two, two boys! Alright, we'll see you guys there. stopped in Twin Falls, Idaho. Um, I think we're still about three to three and a half hours out from Salt Lake City, but uh, check out this amazing view. Higher. Wait. Higher. No, dance. So we can use it. I'm not taking a picture. Take a picture. It's a video. We want to see moves up there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, <lame. laughs> What's up everyone? We just made it to Salt Lake City. We're gonna go visit the convention center. Uh, they have vendors open and uh, we can't play test they said because they have like side events going on. And uh, yeah, we're just gonna go check it out. Hey, check this out. This is Zach's set. He got the uh, shirt with it, which is awesome. The premium package. We got this beautiful chorus experiment promo. And the Giratina mat. We got to avoid the enamors this time. So that, that's awesome. <laughs> oh, and this also comes with two side event tickets. We got Breeze from CCG. Got this amazing little Vulpix here. So cute. We are checking out some vendors currently. This is Richard. Here the Matt and the Rock Ruff. Heck yeah. And we're going to go check out some side events. Yeah. All right. We just left the venue. Time for some food. Breeze is really hungry, right Breeze? I'm starving. We're all super hungry and then we're gonna go somewhere. back to the hotel and do some more testing. We are getting some testing done the night before regionals. Look at all these Idaho guys in here. What's up guys? Brody and I here are wrapping up the night. We're the last ones in the uh, in the hotel lobby center. It's only like 9.30, but everyone wants to get sleep, which makes sense. Um, I'm waiting for Joe. He'll be arriving to the hotel around 11.30. So I am just gonna be staying up. We're working on Brody's Mew deck list just a little bit here. Um, I made a sudden switch, uh, shower thoughts. I was initially gonna run Palkia after uh, running a little bit cold at the 1K with Kiram, uh, but I'm back on it. I'm playing Kiram and I decided to throw in some untested text just because I'm playing the Drapion, just to make the Mew matchup what feels almost free if you can set up properly. But also I'm running the Ice Q instead of Empoleon because I think it just can potentially auto win Blissey. It does have a lot of heals. I think this deck can already be Blissey, so that matchup's like okay. 
but um, it's also very good against Regigigas, which is a very tough matchup. I'm really pumped to be back on Kiram. I'm finally feeling confident again. I just needed that. Uh, just, just to go back on the deck that I've been testing the most. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna head back up to the room here in a little bit. Everyone's showering, I've already gotten ready. And we'll see you guys in the morning. Good morning, everyone. Good morning. It is the beginning of day one of Salt Lake City Regionals. I'm super pumped. We got Breeze here. What's up? What's Last the, second, what's the Breeze leaving. I'm playing Paul okay. and Awesome. Uh, I'm on Kieran Palkia, and the rest of the guys here are on Giratina. So, we'll see you at the venue. What's up guys? Uh, my round one went super well. I am playing Kiram, once again, you guys know that. I went up against Shadow Rider and uh, Mewtwo V-Star. I was able to set up perfectly. My hand was already really good. I actually started with Minion, which wasn't great, but the rest of my hand was good. I battle passed my Capacious Bucket, and then I top decked Arita. So I was like, uh, okay, <laughs> great, that nice. works. Anyway, so turn three, it was two or three, I can't remember now. I was able to one-shot his uh, Shadow Rider Calyrex VMAX. After I took the one-shot on it, he marnied me and everything. I was able to draw out of it. Um, and then the next turn, he couldn't find his boss to knock out my only Palky and play. So I just had V-Star set up for game. And then game two, he went first again. I had Nuts set up, and he completely bricked off of research. So really unfortunate for my opponent, but um, I mean, we take those. Round one, settle the nerves a little bit. I was able to two all my opponent. It was amazing, super cool. Shout out to you, uh, Julio, and uh, good luck to you the rest of this tournament. Breeze? Well, hey guys, you know me, I'm Breeze. Uh, I just played against someone who actually knew who Controlled Chaos was. Really? I believe his name was Thomas. Do you know it, Thomas? Uh, I don't know. Apparently he's moving up to Boise or Meridian area. Oh, Thomas, yeah, we, yeah. Talked, we talked to him for the tournament. Yeah, so I played <laughs> against him today. Uh, it was really sweet. We were playing Palkia Mirror, Palkia and Teleon Mirror. Um, I felt like I was in full control game one, and so um, I just took that control into game two. I took game one pretty pretty easily. I got really lucky because he rock sand me, and my top deck was an Irida. And so that Irida pulled me out of a situation that yeah. looked pretty rough, and I was able to get the absolute nuts combo with like a vacuum on his big charm and everything. So all of that just popped right into place. It was excellent. And then in game two, um, the play was a little slow, but that's totally fine. I understand. For me, I need to speed up as well, especially at one of these regional events. You don't have enough time to actually play three full games. When both game one and game two were really close, it can't blame anyone for playing it out, not scooping up a game. Right. But at the end of the day, uh, starting 0-1, or no, sorry, starting 1-0, <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> I can't complain. So you got a couple of 1-0s over here, feeling yep. pretty good. And uh, Andy went 1-0. Nice. Um, I think TJ lost. Ah. Keegan won. He nice. Won and I think the rest of the team unfortunately lost. I don't think anyone tied. Could be wrong. They could still be playing. They still right. haven't called time yet. They so, have called time. Oh, yes. They have? Yes. Okay. That's how we ended Anyways, up with game we two. We will see you guys at the end of round two. How's it going, everyone? We it's just at the end of round two. I'm here with Mason and Matt and Brody. Let's see, my round one was a uh, kind of like a weird tie. Uh, dude had to go to the bathroom, and the judge gave him a five minute timer. He took almost a whole five minutes. Slow play through game two. By the time we finished uh, game two, they called time, and even with the extra five minutes, we, we were still shuffling our cards. Uh, I figured it'd be better to tie 
round one and then just get paired against the slow players than it would be to lose and get paired against those thinking blissies. So uh, I'm 101 currently. My last round was the mirror match. Really good. The dude played like a 3-3 Giratina. Uh, probably didn't have as much switching cards as we do, so we were able to kind of like... I was able to keep under, under collapsed lock like most of the game. Uh, it was sick. It was a really good match. 2-0, so I am 101. I hope everyone else that is here is doing as good as they wish they could be. And uh, yeah, we'll catch you guys later. All right, we're out here after uh, round three. We, uh, I think it's lunchtime, and there's a lot of a lot of hungry people here. But uh, I'm hungry for some victories. Uh, round three was dope. I beat the Reggie Gigas, which was the matchup that I feared the most. I'm playing um, Lawson Giratina, and it's been a really fun deck. I will say that adding the Collapse Stadium just to tech for the Reggies was was the perfect move. So uh, excited for the afternoon, uh, one and two now. So we'll we'll see if I can climb back to 500. But regardless, Matt, Matt agreed. Everyone's super chill. The Pokemon community is undefeated. So Team CCG doing well. We got to go check in with the rest of the team. But uh, if you're gonna play against the Reggie Gigas and you're uh, Giratina, you might want to add that Collapse Stadium because. It was literally the difference maker, so. All right, we'll see you in round four. What's up, everyone? It's Andy from Controlled Chaos Gaming. We just got done with round four of the regional championships. I am three wins, zero losses, and one tie. We got Matt over here. Matt's still uh, still rocking. Yeah, positive record, so that's really cool. Uh, we're hoping to get you guys some interviews. Uh, one of my opponents was the winner of the Open that happened a couple months ago, so that's really cool. So uh, I'd love to get to... Uh, Day two, we're only a couple wins away, so let's do it. What's up, guys? Matt here. Uh, I, we did miss a report for round five. Um, I ended up losing my round five, so I went to two, two, and one. Um, I went up against Arceus Giratina, playing the Kirapalkia. It feels like an okay matchup, and then they just Marnie Path overturned, and it's really rough. It's my second Arceus Giratina matchup. Um, the first game, I really think I just ended up throwing it. I didn't count my prizes correctly. Um, and I quick balled for a Luminion that wasn't there. So that was really, really rough for me. I was confident in taking that first game. And because of that, I kind of just uh, got in my own head a little bit. And game two, I did just dead draw. I don't feel like there's anything I could have done about that. Um, so that was really rough, but I was able to have enough time to... Uh, Kind of just reset my mind, and then here in round six, I'm up against Kira and Paul Pierre Mirror, and uh, unfortunately we did tie. So I'm sitting at two, two, two. So I am out of day two contention, but I'm still gonna play for points. I'm gonna finish it out, and uh, we'll see how everyone else does. I know Andy is three, two, one. Um, TJ is three, two, one, and Tyler is four, two. Um, I think most everyone else has dropped out because they want to do some side events, but. I've prepared for this for a long time and we came all the way here. I'm going to shoot for all nine rounds. Uh, based on how I'm feeling, of course, I still feel okay. I'm a little bit tired, but um, yeah, on to round seven. What's up, guys? I'm here with someone from Idaho as well. We've got Keegan Morin. Hey, how he are you? He is one win away from day two. Uh, so we're going into round nine here soon. Mason is locked in for day two, and Tyler needs to win his last round, I think, for ID. Uh, the rest of us did not make day two, unfortunately. Um, I'm just playing out my rounds for the experience, and uh, what's the play for today, Keegan? So, my play for today has been RCS V-Star Lundra with Crushing Hammers. Yeah. And the reason why I chose the Crushing Hammers was because I was looking around for some sort of option to be like, what slows down decks so that if I need to be more time to set up, I can do that. I thought Crushing Hammers would be the good answer. And my games today have been turning out great. I had an Arceus Duraludon that I Crushing Hammered all of their fighting energies and they just couldn't attack me. Um, I had a game against a Garantina V-Star last round in which after my after I ran them out of energies, uh, they only had enough energies for one more attack, so I made it to where they couldn't knock out my Boudreau, and they had to knock out something else, or they couldn't get the knockout, and I got the game. Yeah. So yeah, um, hopefully my next game I get a good matchup. 
get six wins. What matchup do you want to see the most in this last round here? I would like to see a Reggie's. I haven't seen uh -huh. a Reggie all day, and I think Reggie's would be a great matchup. That sounds matchup. super free. Alki and Teleon would be good, probably because I don't need bench space, and I think I'd have a better matchup against that. Mm -hmm. um, the thing I don't want to see is Palki and Kirim. Kirim does too much damage. I'm sitting at 3 3 2. I won my last round against Garatina. But like I said, just playing for the experience. We got one more round, and then we're going to go get some food. But uh, good luck to you, Keegan. Yeah, thanks. Go get that win. Uh, yeah, we'll see you guys later. See ya. All right, guys. The day's done. The three winning ends we had uh, two losses and one tie. So none of us made day two. My last round, super rough. Uh, playing against Arceus Agron, and it was just brutal. Awful way to end the day. Breeze. Hey. Found another Gudra. Hey, check just out this Bushy I bought. That's Look, adorable. Silver lining. Nice. I saved my money for the most part, but. Nice. <laughs> we're gonna go eat. Yes. I'm super excited for that. Uh, we have side events tomorrow. Yeah. I'm gonna go enjoy the rest of my night. We'll yeah. see you guys later. What's up, guys? We are uh, enjoying some Jackbox. I cannot show the screen, but we have uh, Andy. What's up? We got Keegan. What's up? We got Zach. We got Breeze. Hey. We got TJ. We got we got TJ. <laughs> and we got Brody. <laughs> how's it going, Brody? Brody, how did you do in your games today? Did you say that? Really? Was that bad, bro? Regionals was an enjoyable experience for you. <laughs> How did regionals you make you feel? TJ, I am sorry. This is for ten dollars. You understand if no one else does. Good morning, guys. We are back at the venue. We got Richard here, we got Breeze, Brody, and me. Like I mentioned, none of us unfortunately made day two, but we're gonna enjoy some side events. This is my first side event with these guys. We got the four-man pod going. I'm thinking about signing up for the GLC tournament. It's only two tickets, and I know TJ and Andy are really, really excited for it. Anyways, we're enjoying ourselves here, and uh, best of luck to everybody in day two. That is going to wrap up our regionals vlog. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, check us out on Twitch. We stream every Monday at five. And uh, just to do a quick recap, we had a great time uh, with side events. That was a lot of fun. Breeze kept beating me. Yeah. And uh, the one thing I won was because he decided to play Durant and didn't make it to finals. But I finished at a record of three, four, and two. And Breeze? I also was three, four, and two. TJ? I was 3-3-1. Three, three, and one. All right. I 3-0'd yep. the GLC tournament, so that's cool. That's awesome, why I awesome. The but yeah, we got everything out of the hotel, so we're going to go back to the Tesla and start heading home. Sweet. We'll see you guys later.